Hi everyone, my name is Siddharth Rathor and I am an assistant professor at the Economics Department of Gatli College. Now I am going to orient you on a paper by the name of Understanding the Economic Survey and the Union Budget. Now this is an SEC that the BA program students can take and let me let me just tell you about in a couple of minutes about this paper. Now, this paper is essentially an, an, an a journey into current affairs, a journey into uh, economic news, what is happening around the country and especially related to the finances of the government, but not uh, just specifically only related to the finances of the government, but that is a ma major portion of this course. Now, uh, let me discuss what all are is there in this particular course. So, if you see what we will start with in this particular course will be uh, understanding the union budget. We will see that how the budget making process in the country happens. Every year you might have heard that on the 1st of February the union uh, finance minister comes and presents the budget. We will discuss that what goes into the structural aspects of the budget and how the finances are managed by, by the country. And then moving on to from the union finances, we'll also see that how these finances are transferred from the center to the states. So that transfer of resources from the center to the states is basically an undertaking which is done by a constitutional body by the name of Finance Commission. Then you would have already uh, heard about uh, as it's part of your daily life, the GST. So we'll see that uh, why GST reforms were done. Uh, what were the benefits of the GST reform, what were the erstwhile systems before the GST reforms and how is the performance of the GST reforms uh, till now. Then we will also see uh, the external sector. You might have heard about uh, a clarion call these days that we should ban Chinese exports, uh, we should uh, we should be uh, focusing on Atman Nirmar Bharat. So we will see that how our BOP, the balance of payment is faced. Uh, faces in the current scenario, uh, what are what are the deficits, who do we import from, what do we import, so all of those issues will be covered. Apart from that, we will see the social infrastructure of, of uh, the country, by social infrastructure we mean the health and the education uh, and the education in the country, specifically we will see what is the state of the health sector as you, uh, as you are experiencing, experiencing that it is because of the poor investment that we have had in the last 70 years in the health sector that uh, we are facing an unprecedented uh, situation in, in our hospitals. Then we will also go into the manufacturing woes of the country that why India is not a manufacturing hub, how is China a manufacturing hub, can we actually become a manufacturing hub in the next 10 years or so. Then we will also apart from apart from all these topics in our in our daily discussions uh, in our in our classroom. Uh, we will also discuss topical news which, which are which are there in the normal business dailies which is uh, issues like the impact of COVID-19 on the Indian economy, uh, the details of Atmanirbhar Bharat, the, what are the government responses to uh, the, the, uh, the pandemic. So all in all this course is actually a journey into current affairs. This course is, some, is, is specifically meant for people who want to get into uh, civil services, state services, any competitive exam, even for your CAT exam, if you are an economic student or not, uh, you should be aware of what is happening in the Indian economy, even your corporate placements, this will help you. Uh, however, going into, uh, if you don't have, if you don't have maths, that, that is not going to be an inhibiting factor for you because there is only one numerical that is asked, which is a very simple, uh, math, which is a very simple uh, numerical, doesn't require any uh, specific tools. And this can course, this course can also be taken for people who have not had an economics background. Then, uh, if you want to go into detail that how I I particularly I take this course, uh, this course has been taught by me for the last four years, and you can find out there is a YouTube link. Uh, this is my YouTube channel. You can find out uh, uh, my pedagogic uh, skills and how I how I teach this course. Uh, this course is, is also there in the economics honors, a similar variant of this course. So you please go through these, these course lectures and you will have pro uh, probably have an idea that what entail. And if you have any other questions, you can always contact me. Uh, my number is mentioned here. The office hours is from 7, 7 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. on the weekdays. You can also drop an email to me if you have any doubts. I hope to see you in the class. Thank you. Bye-bye.